So hello everyone and welcome back to another unboxing video. This time it is an unboxing video from Weird Cult. Oh yes, and it is the second unboxing from Weird Cult on my channel. Yeah. And for those of ones who have been following me for some time now, um, knows that Weird Cult is a shop that is uh, special to me because it's my partner's shop. Um, and so, of course, I, some might think that I'm a little bit biased, um, but I bought some of these things anyway, and well, I also bought them together with my partner, because of course we will only be selling stuff in the shop that we want ourselves. <laughs> Um, and it's a very eco-friendly shop with like second-hand clothing and we are doing everything for the environment and when I say we it's because whenever I have time I help with the shop just to try and well just give it an extra hand and do whatever I can um, just because we came up with the idea together and all of those things um, but it is my partner's shop I have another a job that is almost full time, taking all of my time really. Um, but I do whatever I can, and and well, the stuff is just so amazing that I wanted to show all of you. Um, so let, let's just get started. Yes. So well, let's start with these things. So what actually happened with this was that these are things that we bought together in February um, and well that I bought from the shop so that these are like my stuff but my stuff is also my partner's stuff and such like that. Um, so these are exciting stuff and um, a lot of these products that I'm going to show you are Nemesis Now stuff and you cannot buy from them unless you are like an, a shop that has been evaluated for and approved for an account there so you need to be a shop you cannot buy it as a private person um, and they have some pretty awesome stuff there um, and these are ornaments for the, the Christmas tree and I just love that oh, and it's like with um, witch cats and demonized cats and Baffaboo like a small really cute Baphomet and I can just show you like this one I'm trying to get it to focus a little bit. But there's like such great details. All over this. And it's just perfect for the Christmas tree so I love this and we still have these available on on the shop oh, it's still available on the shop and I will link it down below it is weird cult with a K and not a C just to make it like a Danish appeal to it because it's a Danish shop uh, and so it's top DK but this is just amazing I don't know yet if we will have space for a Christmas tree this year just because stuff is still happening with our living situation and we might not be here for Christmas but I don't know yet so that will be another video it's not totally settled just yet um, but now it's out there <laughs> Um, but oh my, I just love this so much um, that I, oh yes, it's 
it's so good. And also a good thing to know about all this stuff. It's made uh, of resin. And yes, resin is plastic. Um, but resin is, um, what do you call it? Um, a waste product from plastic production. So that's that's a good thing. It's good for the environment that it gets used and not just like wasted, going to waste as waste is unfortunately most of the time. Um, so that is just amazing that they can then make these like figurines and stuff like that and then hand paint them. They are hand painted. Yes. Oh yeah. And like this one I just took before. This one is named Bafaboo. And um, then this one is named Pura. It's mine. How is it? Can you see it? And it is so cute. I, I love that the figures are like made in like a very very cute like a cute style see even the eyes are like glowing I love it and all of the details to the fur and the hat is awesome Just like think about it, a tree filled with like these small black cats and buffaboos all over, it would be amazing. Oh yes, and with lots of other satanic or, or gothic stuff. Oh, to design a Christmas tree that would be lovely. Yeah, but. Maybe next year. I don't know yet. But then I, I have it. I have it already. Or we have it. Me and my partner have it. We are ready whenever that happens. It is so nice. Good. And... This is possible. Maybe this one is my favorite of the ones that I have. Like how many? I have one more. I think this is my favorite. Just because I really like the devil horns. Or not the devil horns. The demon horns. Yeah. They are just so cute. Yes. yes, yes, yes. And they are very well protected. Because. Let me see if I do it. Yes, the right way. They are like in a little bag and then in this flamingo with a lid as well. And then in this one. Mel pass. Yeah. This is also very cute. Actually, I th I think it's my two favorites are the one with the bad wings, this one, Mel pass, and the uh, paw 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 sop, um with the demon 
with the demon um, horns. Yeah. I have flamingo everywhere now. <laughs> Maybe it wasn't such a good idea to be filming this in the bed, but that's just how it is. See this one? It's so cute. Oh, I really love this one as well. Like the creators that thought of these, oh, I love. I just love them. Like yes, continue to do this, please. This is awesome. And it has little fangs. Look if it can like focus. Not on me, on the cat, please. See, I don't know if you can see it, but it has little fangs. It is so cute. So that was four very very lovely figurines for the Christmas tree and you can see some of them here uh, here let me see if I can get it to not reflect too much like that maybe and there's an owl as well and well they are all called uh, cult cuties and that is just exactly what they are, so that is an amazing name. Um, and I actually think that we will be getting, uh, or like the, the owl will be getting on the shop as well, I think if I remember right. And I think I need that one as well. Oh yeah. So, another amazing thing is... This brand of socks, like my partner discovered this brand, Foot Clothes, and they are just amazing. It's a, a woman who owns um, the, sh the uh, brand and uh, she came up with it with her partner and that like the story about it you can read about it at their website but it's like they could not remember what the name of socks were so they named it and they thought it's so funny that they just named it what they could remember and that was foot clothes so i just like that story it's so cute and they are totally right because like how did you come up with the name socks like it's clothes for your feet how did that became socks? I don't know. But look at this. This is just like one of the many, many different designs my partner has on the shop. And I just love it. And these are like not just any pair of socks. Because these are like made with um, very, very good quality of cotton. And with no st stupid or irritating, um, what do you call it, seams that could irritate at the feet down here, at the toes and such. They are so comfortable. Um, and why I say that is because I've actually been having another pair on. So this is like a pair from the shop and these like actually the ones that I have been using <laughs> oh yes and they are so good it's it's just the same pair um, and I will be buying more for myself because they are so good and so soft and so thick but it's it's just perfect for me because I always have like cold feet or else I need like two or three pairs of socks just for my boots not to chew on my feet or something like that and meanwhile, these are just amazing and good for the environment as well. Oh yes, and made with love. And it's, it's just so good because a lot of the nice pattern ones that I found before, they are like these very, very, very cheap um, produced socks 
like from H&M or something even worse and they are itchy and they are like in some kind of hard material that is annoying on the feet and they have these irritating um, seams and well I have them on for like three or four times and then I have holes in them or something and then I throw them out so this is good these are like really in for a battle before they break because mine are just fine yes this is awesome they are nice okay I will I have to put these back because or else I will have two pairs of the same one. <laughs> I have to remember to do that. So, I have another thing from the shop down here. And this one is heavy. It is this. It's a notebook. And. I have been searching for such a notebook for a long time. Like, I really wanted a special one. Um, I have seen a lot of spell books, dream books, and all of those uh, witchcraft books and, and such. And we also have uh, some on the shop, or my partner has on the shop. Um, but this one is just extraordinary. Look at this. It is resin, so it's a resin, it's a resin case, as you can say, on top of the notebook. And it's like, listen to this. So it's it's really hard. And then, and the details, yes. And it's on the back as well. Like, look at all the roots and stuff like that. And actually, I don't know yet what I will be writing in it. I just felt like I needed it when I ever I saw it. Um, the pages are blank, so it could be like for writing, it could be for drawing, it could be for notes, it could be for whatever you feel like you need, really. Um, this is very hard as well. I think it's the same material as the front. Very hard. Um, yeah. But the pages are just lovely blank. Love that. Um, I think I will be using it for writing. Um, maybe doing some calligraphy or something. My partner is amazing at doing calligraphy, so maybe I should ask them to teach me someday. Because whenever we have to write like cards, I always ask my partner because they are so much better at it than, than me. <laughs> Even though I also write like similarly pretty, but not in any comparison to what they can. They are very good at it. So awesome. And it's called the Tree Beard Notebook. So, of course, that makes sense. It really is awesome. Oh, yes. Yeah. And finally, but not least, this box you have been watching, maybe. This little thing that we bought as well, and it has actually been living in our living room just well since we were packing or depacking or. Taking all of our stuff out of the boxes and actually making a living room out of our living room. <laughs> so, 
it is so awesome it is right here look at this oh my details oh my oh my even the horns and look there at the top so of course this is like another Baphomet we we love Baphomets like yeah we do it is awesome so the coagula it says Latin yes and I just love like look at the eyes as well it looks live in just the right way I love it like it's not like there's been really been some detail in this not not just well, we need to make a figure and then be done with it you can look down here as well and also here at the neck or just behind maybe better you can see all of like the fur pattern and such it's amazing so yeah this one is crazy we want to have like these things out and about it in our house like all year round but if you don't want it like all year round you can only like buy it for just like some halloween decor well of course then with with these ones we buy it as our christmas presents or not christmas christmas present but our christmas decor um but just like in halloween spirit of course or like gothic satanic spirit something like that we just love it um yeah so why not do it for the rest of the house yeah <laughs> if you agree with me comment in the comment down below that would be funny um but yeah i would love to hear whatever you think of these things I, I'm just making this video for like sharing this with all of you because I just find it so lovely like I feel it's good quality it's well thought of and like the uh, the way it's done with hand painting so n no n none of these are like completely the same because it's not made in a machine you know it's molding and then it's hand painted well, but it's pretty damn similar and it's just very very good handcraft I love it yes it's amazing yeah. so I hope that you like these things just as much as, as I do or maybe just like a little tad like I do maybe <laughs> and I hope that I, I can make like another video for you soon about the shop because um, we actually just uh, bought some new secondhand clothes together for the shop and we also bought a lot of new stuff from Nemesis now and some of it if it were like stuff that we needed to get more home of the same that we have had before but we also got many new items oh yes and we are still waiting for that and it should be arriving tomorrow so Hopefully, because we need it before Halloween, you know. Um, but thank you so much for watching and see you all next time. Bye.